Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is July 10th, 2024. I had to think about what the year was. Uh, yeah, let's do a random prom that I haven't done yet. Uh, yeah, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me in Discord. Let me know what you think about this one here. I am just trying to do an extra one. Did they change my UI? Didn't I have a... Did I have this earlier today? I don't think, like on my other video? I don't think so. How do I change it back? Did they just, uh, huh. Maybe they just won't let me change it back anymore. No. I just don't like this. I guess some mid button up here is kind of good, but I, I, I don't know why there is this shortcut. Can I disable shortcuts? Hmm. Okay, there you go. I could disable these, but they should not be on by default. Who who the hell needs to, you know, make that thing? Uh, I guess this is okay for now. We'll see. I just don't. Yeah. Like I feel like this should be on this side. Oh, what the? Okay, maybe this is useful. I don't know. We'll see. Can we just make it shrink this for now? All right. Sorry, friends. I guess now we're in the new layout. I can't. I don't know how to go back. Maybe if. Oh, wait, no. We wrote the old version. Okay, there you go. All right, there you go. Uh, much better. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Just trying to. I don't know what the hell. What, what, what is happening? What is happening? But yeah, today let's take a look at a problem that I haven't done yet. 794 valid tic tac toe state. Given the. Return true if it's only possible which the state. Okay. The first one is X, the second one is O, so we want to see if this board is possible. This is not possible because it's okay. Mm, okay, so I think f for these kind of problems, the key thing is just to figure out, you know, the invariance that you're trying to figure out, right? And maybe it's okay to kind of like in, in the beginning just to be overly exhaustive. And I mean, like even with certain scenarios overlap each other it's okay just you know you just want to focus on correctness and optimize it later um the first thing we want to know is that x number of x has to be one or greater than this o's right like yeah okay so then let's do that um so x is equal to zero o is equal to zero right so now for i in range of three uh, just call it n where n is equal to three uh for j in range of n uh if board sub i j is equal to x then x increment by one else if board i j i maybe i should have used a switch statement because we were just using it in the other video but yeah and then now right so if o is mm, yeah, if O is greater than X or X is greater than O plus 1, then we return false, right? Just because there's too much of O's or too much of X's. And then the other one that we should check is um, if X wins, or oh, sorry, if O wins, there cannot be an extra X, right? So that means that if O wins, then it has to have the same number of X and O's, right? So, okay, so, so we have to do um, X win is equal to force, O win is equal to force. Um, maybe this is where, you know, we start using um, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, something like this, right? It's a little bit whatever, but but it, it allows us to kind of modulize it a little bit. Right, so then now we can say x is equal to count x, o is equal to count o, right? And then now we, in a similar way, we can maybe have a win function, right? Um, which is for i in range of n, right? So Yeah, I mean, uh, 
if all j uh yeah if all what's sub i j is equal to c for j in range of n then we return true um so that's for the no that's for the uh no that's for the row right so then we want to do the same thing for die um uh for uh what you might call it the columns right and then now we have to do the diagonals um Right, so that's one diagonal, and you could do the other one. Maybe, uh, uh, I don't know, maybe there's a cleaner way to write this, but uh, yeah. But then now, uh, this is going to be win of x, win of c, right? Uh, uh, oh, why, what am I saying? If So if they both win, then we turn false, that's just awkward. So if x win, then then um, x has to be o plus 1, right? Because x when, x, when their turn ends, right? So if o wins, then, if, then they have to be the same uh, count. Um, is that good enough? Maybe. Okay, I mean, it's good enough for these three examples of whatever it is. But am I confident? To be honest, not really. But and but some of my ideas is not from these rules, of course. It's because I know how to play tic-tac-toe. Uh, or at least I know the rules a little bit. And here's my ideas. I don't know that I, I've missed anything, but, you know, that's basically the ideas that I have now. All right, let's go give it a submit. Hopefully I don't miss anything. And, okay, it looks okay. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I was probably like, 80% confident about this when I submitted it just because I don't know it's just so it's kind of hard to get every case in a rule based thing um, but the only reason why I think I'm able to do this in a reasonable time to be honest is because I know tic-tac-toe right like if you give me a new game then we have to kind of examine all these things in a really strange way which is kind of very um, just hard uh, or like you have to be like you have to think about all the edge cases which maybe it's tricky to do sometimes but yeah what's the complexity here well i mean everything's going to be um depending on how you want to uh define n because it's n or well, the input size is always going to be the same even though it's an array so you can say that input size is all one i don't know so that everything is going to be because the inputs input size does not vary so you could maybe say it's constant time constant space or you can say this is linear time linear space or not even linear space i guess actually just constant space either way but linear time because if you want to say that the board size you know gets bigger or whatever um because we have to look at you know this the, the entire board a couple of times uh also cut myself that's why i keep on looking at my wrist so i keep on hitting myself and it hurts i mean not like you know just a little bit of a nag but uh yeah um that's all i have for this one let me know what you think thanks for watching Stay good, stay healthy, do your mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye-bye.